It's not a lump of coal, but it is uh, probably a little bit or maybe a lot worse. The U.S. Treasury Secretary opened a Christmas box this weekend. It was a gift, and he found that gift was actually a box full of horse manure. The self-styled protest came from a Los Angeles psychologist who said he did it to protest the recently approved tax bill. It's a case that set us thinking, what's the line between ordinary mischief and criminal activity? On your sides, Ann Schindler started digging into what has become a really nasty trend. Okay. Hold on, hold on. Judge is in session. What is the problem here? You put my stuff in jello again. <laughs> the office prank. Really? If I can skin a mule deer in less than 10 minutes, I ought to be able to cut my. The goal is to be funny, not kind. But some pranks aren't either, at least if you're on the receiving end. No! And I came by the office to get the mail and had. This nice package. That was the case with Jacksonville attorney John Phillips, who this weekend found a surprise in his mailbox. Poop. It says you've been pooped on. Poop by mail is an actual thing. You can choose what animal. Numerous websites offer a variety of prank mailings. Sloth, shit, wolf urine, Komodo dragon poop. The missives clearly redefine the term gag gift. But according to Jacksonville attorney Susan Cohen, they're not actually illegal. Horse manure is not per se, a hazardous material, it doesn't appear that there's anything that makes it illegal. The same is true of other prank presents, like glitter bombs. <laughs> Unless the gift itself damages property or is accompanied by an explicit threat, Cohen says the law is silent on the issue. The real question is, is that a threat? Is somebody threatening somebody or are they just offending somebody? Which is not a criminal matter. Just because there's no law yet doesn't mean there will never be. I think it's safe to say we're in a new age. If only because of the absurdity of the question at hand. How far does speech go? And is poop itself speech? I, I, I appreciate it. As for the Jacksonville attorney uh, you know, who got the unwanted made. gift, he money. still managed to muster yeah, a courteous right. thank so, you. Thanks for the poop. Waste of money. Bye, guys. Merry Christmas. Ann Schindler, First Coast News, on your side. Hmm. Now, the man who sent the manure to the Treasury Secretary, he did get a visit from the Secret Service and the bomb squad. He also says he expected to lose his job over it. As of now, though, no charges have been filed.